Yo, what is up? This is Joshua Casper. Welcome to another Ableton Live Very Quick Tip. This one's on placing DLL or VST files into the correct folder for use inside of Ableton. Sometimes when you download a VST, it just has a DLL file like this one here. Um, and you, it might be a bit confusing for beginners because there's no EXE file or whatever it is in on a Mac so I just want to use this VST but there's not an executable file that's going to do all that for me so I just need to place this into the correct file so the way you do that is you go into the Explorer, you go into Computer, Local Disk, Program Files, Ableton whichever version you're using, Resources and then you go to Devices, PC and then you just can drag it anywhere in here if you folder you can just add a new folder I got a folder called odds and ends and that's where I want to put these so these are two new VSTs that I'm just gonna drop it's gonna say you need administrative positions is that cool you hit continue it'll move them in there close out of that and then we're gonna open up live and hopefully they're in there and working okay so I've opened up live and we're gonna go into my plug-in devices over here and we're gonna see if the yeah here we go two VSTs came in um, just like I wanted them to and now I can go ahead and use them cool anyway I hope that helps peace